Hello, this is a tutorial number three. It is the extension of uh, restaurant uh, point of sales school version. So now user, normal customer can order from the website. So look at that, this is a web extension of uh, your existing restaurant post uh, SQL version. So those um, all uh, items integrated with uh, desktop uh, applications. Here you can filter, customer can browse everything. It's too nice uh, design. So, oh, and uh, when customer ordering from here, it's automatically display your uh, restaurant um, SQL, restaurant point of sales SQL version kitchen display, and you can order, you can print invoice and send to home at delivery. So. Let's go to add one page slice. And then check out put note and condition is optional. Put the customer name, phone number, and uh, delivery address. And then press proceed. So customer can print uh, invoice. And this one automatically goes to restaurant uh, with the sauce options. So now let's open. Uh, this invoice number is uh, 25 and let me check here is the invoice number 25 we order three item uh, one is a pizza slice pizza medium and uh, mix copy Pizza slice, pizza medium, mix copy, milk and salt. Milk and salt. How you know that it's come from web? It's easy, very easy, because we mentioned here, this is web, this one web order. This order come from website customer order and you those are you order that's why there is no mention this one also web order um, there is this is a dex of application order so it's easy to understand which one come from order and you can find the uh, receipt you can print a, a receipt so this is a system so web system order uh, that's why and then you can also print invoice uh, with uh, your product uh, Here is a three types of uh, invoice uh, You can print a receipt you can print invoice with your food There is a <clears throat> client customer uh, Address so you remember we just um, import customer import uh, this address from website and source options everything uh, <clears throat> so you can uh, print it and then move to and also uh, it's mentioned cash on delivery so <clears throat> just attached uh, this uh, receipt with your uh, food Let me check, let me try another one. Now is the twenty five. Uh, let's check. This is a, okay. Order is ready. 
let's try to do again one another one just synchronizing automatically synchronize this one and it's also mobile uh, responsive web template so this web not not these applications uh, this one uh, so customer can easily order from using mobile applications let's try to order So it's automatically come, it automatically instantly come to your kitchen display. Now see the invoice number 26. So milk, chicken, tea, and uh, McDouble. So using uh, this web uh, applications, uh, web extension of uh, SQL uh, uh, version, restaurant post SQL versions, a customer uh, can easily order from anywhere around the world when you host, uh, hosted in a web server, or you can um, display another separate task screen monitor in internal, in your restaurant so then customer uh, also can make order from uh, your in inside the restaurant or you can easily take order waiter can take order using tab so because before this application is not supported into tab but web this one is support any device because when you hosting inside the web server so you can browse inside the mobile tab desktop application whatever so we can easily take order from any device and then you can serve uh, uh, using this uh, uh, desktop applications so um, and uh, inside the solution you can find uh, uh, whole uh, <clears throat> documentation here is a uh, whole documentation uh, set up user guide so um, you easily is is nothing just uh, open with uh, a school server with the visual studio because you already set up database so you don't need to uh, set up again when you set up a database for these applications uh, you can easily use just you have to configure uh, you have to just put your database name and SQL server identifications and then open with um, Visual Studio and then run easily uh, and a hosting package you have to purchase a hosting and domain and then you can easily host uh, these uh, web extensions and customer also uh, print uh, this invoice uh, for the record but it is not necessary you over your um, uh, inside your system all the record so you can uh, print uh, easily and how you know that uh, this come from customer side it is very uh, easy look at that here look at that here this is a salesman sold by but this one sold by cust uh, system this is mentioned as a system so uh, you have you easily can understand this is uh, come from a customer side uh, because otherwise uh, everything is mentioned uh, this is admin uh, take this order uh, this username so sold by 
followed by username so you can easily identify the uh, where, where come from this order so then you can uh, print order and then sa serve your uh, serve your food or send your food home delivery so using this uh, extensions very very flexible very easy to take the order from customer and using any device uh, even if you host uh, this application you get the order from outside in your res in your area but uh, normally uh, any can uh, use your website around the world you know better than me thank you for watching this video hope you enjoyed this video and don't forget to like and subscribe thank you